All right, so just responding to a video about questions about hooking up the RC2 to an iPad so you can use an iPad as a secondary controller. So I had a couple of people say they were having issues with it and the question was, um, does the new firmware updates and everything stop this? And at this point, I don't know. I haven't tried it. I've been connecting, uh, I have connected my Avada 2, the new Avada 2 to this and it was done wirelessly, so that was great, not wired. But I have my cable here, I have everything I need. So I'm gonna swap over to my trusty dandy um, Go 3 here for a POV shot. All right, so we have our iPad and the, the Orion app right there. We have our RC2 switched off currently because we need it in the switched off position. And we're gonna link up Go to the Orion app, plug in our cable, which to tell me it's over here. So the port's actually here, not here. The app thinks it's here. Let's close out the app and see if, there we go. So it correct itself, it tells me to put it in right there. Normally at this point, the screen goes to the color it should. And I might have to do a little reset of the iPad first before this decides to work. I've been using um, this setup with the the receiving cable for the HDMI with a micro HDMI into the back of my Sony camera and using my iPad as a, a monitor when I'm doing certain things. And that's worked out perfectly. So the Orion app is still working good with the iPad uh, and my Sony camera. So really it's just a case here if um, maybe the DJI update, which we think it could be. So I'm gonna turn my iPod off real quick. And that was the fix in my original video, right? When I couldn't get it to work the first time. So uh, finicky, yes. Um, we've had people in the comments of that original video say it did work for them and then other people saying it didn't work for them. So hard to say. Do I feel like a right goof with this uh, camera on my head? Maybe. There we go. So that's what I'm looking for. Moment of truth. Goes to black, which means it's typically picking up the signal. And yeah, so I can confirm for anyone who's wondering, this is the most up-to-date version of the app. This is the most up-to-date version on the controller. It still works. So it's the Ugreen, is it Ugreen? Yeah, who do both of these cables. So as simple setup as you get. Um, iPad on the most up-to-date, and not the beta though, but the most up-to-date iOS and firmware on the new the new release since the Avada 2 got released, all my stuff got updated with that and I've successfully used it in that way as well. Which if you didn't know, when you click into say the goggles, you can, uh, there's a little button that comes here, you click into the goggles and you say you wanna do a screen share, you hit this button because it comes up and it basically, uh, actually sorry, you hit this button right here and it does it. So there we go, uh, that is, let's get this off. So if you have any questions beyond this, let me know, but it is still working for me. And if you have any issues, you know, we'll try and work through them, but uh, I can confirm it's looking good and still working, which I expected, but you never know with an update, it might throw something off, but yeah, I can confirm all looks good to me. Thanks, bye.